New twist in the Vista High School locker room assault investigation. Late this afternoon, the school district confirmed the players involved in the assault have been suspended and removed from the football team. Good evening. I'm Kimberly Hunt. And I'm Lindsay Pena. The district has seen a string of protests this week over that incident. ABC 10 News reporter Nia Watson shows us how the district got to today's decision. In a video to parents and students Friday, Vista Unified Superintendent Dr. Matt Doyle saying the incident has caused pain and anger throughout the Vista community. Sadness and disgust are precisely the reactions I had when I saw students treating one another in such a cruel manner. The outrage boiled over into protests this week at Vista High School in the district's office as people demanded answers and actions from school officials. In the video, Doyle acknowledges a group of football players bullied a student in the locker room. It is very clear from the disturbing video that a student was physically and emotionally assaulted. Doyle did not go into detail about what took place, but says the student was not sexually assaulted, despite what was said in the video of the incident. He adds several students have been removed from the football team and suspended from school. Meanwhile, some parents are sharing concerns about other students safety. In an email to ABC 10 News, a Vista High parent says her son, who's not on the football team but is a student athlete, is being affected by the incident, saying, quote, many students and adults continue to harass, threaten and spread gossip, flaming emotions and putting the safety of other students at risk. Doyle also urging the community to stop harassing and threatening the football team. And as we do our work, please help us to keep the campus calm and safe for all students and staff. Neil Watson, ABC 10 News. Vista High's varsity football game tonight has been canceled due to safety concerns. Doyle did not give an update on the status of the head football coach. He was put on leave during investigations.